Hey there, if you want to show your Discord game activity on mobile, you are in the right place. So in order to continue, first of all, you need to have the already downloaded version of the Discord here application in your phone. And what I want to do first of all, in order to continue, because sometimes it doesn't appear, you need to go into your app store or in your play store, whatever the option you have to. And in here, you want to look for your applications and see if the application that you are looking for, in my case is Discord, has been already updated as uh, today because there are a lot of things that we have to update, right? Now, as you can see, I have the latest version. So here's the 148. So everything has been great so far. Now, what I want to do is to go back into Discord, is to clear all my cachets in here. After I clicked in here like just twice, what I want to do is to go into my account and scroll all my way up until I see the set status, right? So I can see the online, the adult, the don't disturb, the invisible and set a custom status. So actually we cannot use like an activity on mobile lab, like say for example, that you are playing, I don't know, maybe Mario or something like that. It's not going to be appearing here the game activity on the mobile unfortunately what we can do is to set a custom status so if i am playing let's say for example the mario kart so if i am playing let's say for example the mario kart i can go in here uh playing right and i can go into safe and here is my status the other thing that i can do is to go into my privacy and safety and in here, I have to display current activity as a status message. So I can enable that. I can go back and everything has now been successfully done. Now, just be sure that inside the settings, go into the accessibility section and enable the synced with device settings in order to see what's happening inside your device. And of course, what you guys want to do is to look for your authorized applications. And here you might see that there's something called activity status. This might be only available for a Play Store, a Android account. If you don't see that, you can always clear your cache. And here uh, you might be already ready set to go into your this good account. So now that my status has been already saved, it I can see now my status playing my card too. I can go back into my direct messages, and everything has been successfully done. So there you have it guys, it wasn't that hard, just in case you have any questions, you can leave that down below in the comment section, hopefully this was a very useful video for you. If you find there's another tip, if you find that there's another solution, you can leave that in the comments below too, you can always tell us like the up new update of this code, since this code is an application platform that constantly is been changing the updated and improving their stuff. So thank you guys again guys, and I'll see you next time.